what did these two things have in common? Being the Saskatchewan Wanderer, I knew that Saskatchewan had great mountain biking trails, I knew that Saskatchewan was perfect for sailing and hot air ballooning, I even knew that Saskatchewan had a unique fashion industry. But what I didn't know was that the genetics from Saskatchewan cattle are shipped and used all over the world. We've marketed bulls across North America. We've had bulls go all the way over to Prince Edward Island. We've had bulls go throughout the U.S. We've had uh, cattle go to Mexico as well. And then our genetics, so by genetics I mean the, the semen and the embryos. We've exported that to South America, to Australia, throughout the world. Small town Saskatchewan and, and a big reach. I had the opportunity to visit the Howe family farm just south of Moose Jaw. I'm Julianne Howe and we're at the Howe family farm, home of White Cap Charlie and Howe Red Angus. We're a mixed farm operation but our pride and joy is our cattle. Julianne Howe has a master's degree of science in ruminant nutrition and microbiology. As well, she and her husband Kelly both have bachelor's degrees of science and agriculture majoring in animal science. The Howe family farm works very hard to care for their cattle. They incorporate technology into their operations by using surveillance cameras and online records to keep track of their breeding lines. They all believe that maintaining the land for future generations is important. Julianne hopes that her children will one day take over the operation. My husband and I, we are the third generation. Our kids are the fourth, will be the fourth generation on this farm. What do you like about living on a farm? Um. Riding on a tractor. Do you think you're going to be a farmer when you grow up? Yeah. Yeah? I had the chance to help prepare the cattle for an upcoming sale. Even cows have to get their hair done every once in a while. For more information, you can visit howfarm.ca or saskatchewan.ca slash agriculture.